I forsake myself on this person. One person that did not follow up comments. I don't handle it when someone forced me to do something. Speak to the girl if it made no sense. I see myself also as a skeptic person. That is mainly due because I have a lot of uh, experiments with people that are being unhonest, that are lie, that are profit for me, that are first say, oh, uh, I see you back here, and that are not any kind of friends of Concerns so that they later on that no can hurt from themselves anymore. There've been also a lot of bullied on school. It was always the uh, not popular one, always the weird. Uh, I like more playing with animals because they don't insult me or harass. Because I was different. One of the, one of the reasons that I've become deep. When I come to my attention how animals be treated in the animal, so I like to call it to Holocaust. Holocaust means in Hebrew the sacrifice of a young new animal of her first. You write that it not can be used. And it makes people upset. When you use it for the original designed victims. Humans can be so hypocritical and false. And most be honest. They're being real. They don't manipulate. They don't lie. They see. Oh, what their half is honest. Lying, manipulating is unsocial behavior. You make nothing better, you make only things worse. It is quietly unintelligent behavior. Contrary with most of uh, I think mo one of the most, pro of the biggest problems of our society. And then societies in general is that nobody wants to speak about the truth. Anybody wants to play their own little fantasy games. All want to play that anybody play by our rules. And nobody wants to know the truth. Because there are all create some uh, vacuums. Oh. The anti-feminists, the feminists, all the group of humans that have created their own subculture. And I uh, put attention on the world cult because this was a good action. Nobody think uh, for themselves, anybody play by the rules that are being put up by them. Nobody think for themselves anymore. Anybody t do just what they're being told. They're being good to the point of being puppets. If you've been only good because you've been afraid of punishment, that makes you not a good person, in my opinion. One thing that I think people have to learn in this age is to, to think to learn to think for themselves. If it were out things for if it being true, not following someone else blindly. Being not afraid to ask questions is not something wrong. 
If I have one thing learned in life, is that most humans, being, because they're being so full with dogmas, lies. And lies be not only in your religion or your politics, lies be everywhere. Lies be, lies be in your, uh, in your uh, golf club, lies be in your business club, lies be in your school, lies be in your uh, sports club, lies be everywhere, in every place, everywhere. If I have one thing learned is that humans always lie for some reason. Most of the time it is not so quite frank. I choose to for, uh, be true to myself. So so I'm um, for the death of the um, I'm being ridiculed by others. Then I encourage my own efforts and be false. Maybe that looks and um, um, that looks um, arrogant to you. Again, I do truly don't care because something that I've also learned is no matter where you stand for, no matter what you believe. There will be always ones that hold your thorns, your philosophy, your uh, spirit, your ideals. You can be negative or positive, you can take it any way. But as long as you use logic, rationality, and not go by a uh, primitive um, unbelievable uh, violent traditions and beliefs and habits they've been based on conference Stand for where you stand for. If you know that something is right, and something don't harm when other living being, for example veganism, animal rights, and not harmed or violent an animal or human or actually an innocent living being that would go by that criteria I don't care what you do it's just not your rights based on your traditions your beliefs and your habits to deny other living beings their freedom so that you can enslave them and murder them Modified them like uh, computers, like uh, TVs, like iPads, like mobile phones, and like any on and any proven uh, living being since you think humans be so full with arrogance and so full with hatred. Against the animals, and I don't understand it. What have a pig, a cow, and chicken, or not, or animal ever done? Is what I've asked myself in the whole life. To deserve internal damnation. That somebody cuts their throats, hang them upside down, commodify to them, say that their life don't matter, stupid, labeled them stupid and dirty. Just like humans have done with uh, many other groups of humans around the whole history. The Greeks, for example, they are, uh, of ex have uh, democratic ideas, but 
all other groups that are that don't belong to them, they are blindly labeled as barbarians. Just like the slave masters have done. In uh, America, in South Africa, and take their slaves and use them like objects. It seems that humans. Yes, actually. There are slave masters labeled with also the uh, blacks, the stupid barbarians, savage beasts. Seems that humans that been in power always misuse their power. Of course, not all. But just enough to make anything worse. You know, people that have been in power we know is evil, psychopathic, insane. Money horse. Evil bastards, violent, brutal, psychopaths. I personally don't give about you much. I can only give about innocence. We give them about innocent living beings. Humans? That you've been a human, don't make me do anything for you. Not more than you've been a cockroach. Or you've been a fly. Or you've been a tick on the back of a dog. As humans have no moral fun. And you come for the popular opinion. And I stretch the word opinion. Humans have no right to live that not can be overlooked. Since when is the vandal more important than the victim? What makes humans more special, more holy, more Deserving of protection than a cow, a chick, or a pig. Some humans be stupid, but are born and become not smart ever in the whole life. Means that that you then have the right to murder this human. All you all things that humans can put up to uh, claim their superiority. You can. Deeper. So if it not being absolute, then it cannot uh, put um, other humans to give more rights and more security on somebody on something else and give them the right to discriminate between other humans. You have to have animal rights in your moral code if you want to fight for, uh, for uh, human rights at least to some degree to have, uh, have uh, any uh, serious because no of all criteria can be put only to humans for example some humans be smarter than other humans to have the same. Just now, so just. Give it then the humans that mean more smart, more rights than another? No, that's insane. If we don't give more rights to uh, priests, priests, or we don't give more rights to uh, religions leaders? Yes, because there are more religions, or them over to uh, professors, because there are more. Uh, Intelligence means more smart, or to um, I would just say to police because they're uh, 
protect the stage. And if we if we do, then this being actually a kind of arbitrary criteria. And you don't can be for discrimination based on arbitrary criteria. Arbitrary criteria being, for example, that you have done one study to uh, we police your police your gang and therefore you be more superior. Uh, but you rape your wife and that make you actually doesn't so just not more superior because most uh, cops uh, violate other people's their rights, in particular black people and people that look different and act different. Many also uh, kick uh, dogs for the for fun, or kick men, or, or kick uh, robots. Not all cops. Some cops do actually good stuff. They save dogs or um, they save um, people from criminals. But many others do horrible stuff. Not all firemen be good person. Some um, torture uh, animals with um, with water and kick them. Some uh, molest a wife. Just saying. But to be vegan make you actually more uh, more secure. Uh, human supremacist, speciesistic scumbag. And you understand that humans have actually no moral fiber. Then he become pretty easily to see all the horrors and all the floods and all the stupidity of humankind. You become a mystical. You seems to become one power. And you strength from society. This point it's on humankind. And all of his absurdities and horrors. And this is all flies from it. Animal rights is just, I have to say it, it is about justice. Animals be not food, clothing or the entertainment, just like women be not punchy bags or rape toys for their boyfriends and husbands. And yes, women be more oppressed, no exploited than men. For example, what if it be not uh, if that be not true, why is Omar's man feel upset when some other men call them a sissy? Or one or you call one a sportsman, one uh, woman, one girl, or something like that? If that be not sexist no? First raid on the stupidity of humankind, the mission trap is hard to become an sign from society's absurdities. Why humans not can learn that any living being, no matter which the nature of the being deserve the equal rights, deserve the same right of protection, and this kind of stuff. Why? Why you must have to always try to find excuses for their evil and wrong behavior? Why you must always make excuses for tormenting, abusing? and exploited other living beings. Around history, we have done it over and over and again. We have done it with blacks, we have done it with women, we have done it with... with... Uh, 
Nature or Miracles, we have done it with any group on the whole face on the earth. Can we not go to the plate and say that any living being deserves their legal rights? Why not? Go just vegan. And help to end all the extreme amount of harm and cruelty that being put by the meanest species that ever have roamed this planet, the human animal. To like a devil. Peace begins on the dinner table by what you eat on a daily basis. You don't get pray for peace and then do hypocritical final things. That's not how the world works. You don't can be bait for discrimination based on arbitrary criteria. The dogs, the cats, the being the same as the pigs and the cows at least. So stop with making stupid and insane cruel excuses for putting a sentient being to this horror.